The other thing that I want to talk about is eye contact. How many of you are good with eye contact? Oh, good. Oh, good. Okay. All right. Well, here's the bad news. Most of us aren't. <laughs> and the majority of people in this culture do not give good eye contact. Does anybody want to tell me what is the right amount of eye contact when you're first meeting somebody? Just enough. Thank you, Lonnie. <laughs> and that would be, <laughs> Lonnie's my target. When I need a volunteer, Lonnie's getting up here. <laughs> As opposed to not too much. <laughs> That's right. Don't ever do it. All right. So with the eye contact, when I was first um, starting to give these classes, I watched people, and they were not giving me eye contact, and I didn't understand why. Well, it's because most people don't know how to give enough eye contact, or they give too much eye contact. So what you want to do is you want to look in the inverted triangle area, which is from the tip of the eyebrow to the tip of the eyebrow. You draw a straight line across and then a straight line diagonal here. This is the inverted triangle area. Your goal, if you're not giving uh, good eye contact, is just look somewhere in this area, okay? And then look away. Now you want to look to the left or the right, not down. Down is a sign of submission. Left or right, break away. Your goal is to look at somebody long enough to figure out what the color of their eyes are. That's usually about three to five seconds, okay? And then look away. If you look any longer, it gets a little uncomfortable. Once you get to know somebody, you can give them more eye contact. Like I'm giving her good eye contact we just met, but I know she's not gonna shy away from it. What you wanna be prepared is that most people will not give you that much eye contact. You might make them uncomfortable, gauge them three to five seconds of eye contact. 